get great weather here. We've got hardworking people here. Small town friendly is not just a not just a slogan for Rockford County. We live that every day. The foothills are where the rolling Piedmont of the central part of the state meets the mountains of the western part of the state. So you have a nice dynamic of some gentle rolling plains, but it's also surrounded by these majestic mountains. first got here, we were basically at the tail end of all the, the textile industry leaving the county. Uh, we started working hard to kind of recoup from that, bringing in and trying to diversify the, the industry that we had here. 15 to 20 years ago, this area was heavy into textiles, and as the 90s progressed, we started seeing more companies move, and we, we lost tens of thousands of jobs. The Rutherford County worker, I would sense, would be resilient, hardworking, and, and very innovative. I mean, they had to transform the economy from the old textile economy and the furniture economy to what we see today. I think that the, the folks in Rutherford County embody the American spirit because of having to face major layoffs in the area. The actual fact that we have attracted a national company here ha has been that glimmer of hope that has been needed to, to kind of re-energize the folks in the area. A data center is a very large warehouse where computers live. Uh, on average, we have uh, roughly 600 people working at any given time on, on campus. And, and fortunately, the labor force is quite talented in the area, so we've been very lucky. Fulton Technology is basically a manufacturing facility that we work in the metalworking industry. One of the big projects was the cooling shrouds for the servers, which is part of the integral system to kind of keep the servers cool, which is obviously very important. It enabled us to increase our manufacturing capabilities, and we did that by adding some new machinery and also adding a few extra team members. It was great for our company. When we are working in a community, we become a part of the community and try to help out in whatever way that fits for all parties involved. Facebook grants have been very important to Far City because we've been through, since about 2008, a, a, a huge downturn in the economy. They want to be, be a good community citizen. Very few companies do that. Uh, right away, you know, in a very short period of time, Facebook has come to the community and, and provided grants to us that will benefit our patients and benefit our ability to communicate throughout the area. One grant went towards the purchase of a fetal monitoring system and a physician sees real time what's occurring with the baby or what's occurring with the mother. So the physician can instruct the nurse in terms of what services should be provided. Since Facebook's moved in, I would say there's definitely a bigger sense of pride um, with the county. The Data Center Institute is one in which is unique. We're the only community college in North Carolina at present that has built the institute to provide training for those who hope to be interviewed or employed through places like Facebook. Thanks for being here, Facebook. Thanks for being here, Facebook. Facebook likes Rutherford County. <laughs>